you do? What are you doing, huh? <laughs> Show me that one picture. <laughs> Show me a pretty face. Baby. Baby, what are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> what did my dad say when he saw you? Tell me that joke. Which one? The first one. No, not Jeremy. Sick. What'd my dad say? What'd that pie brunch make? <laughs> it's oh. not that funny. <laughs> yeah, I bet you wish you could have yourself a piece of this. I, I look at my awesome feet. They're size 10. And they're like man sized feet. Nom 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 nom. Like my granny panties. Ew! Ew, spider! See something awesome? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Want me to make my ass clap? Hey, Angelo. Look at those burgers. They have cheese on them. Look at that lettuce. It's green. Look at these hot dogs. They look like penises. And there's some poke chops up in this piece. Um, that's salami and pasta and cheese. I don't know what that is. Rice, masca chow, hey nigga. There's a broom on the wall. Shouldn't it be on the floor so you can sweep? Dude, why are you looking through their food? I got It's my 30th and um, Andy got um, taken away by the FBI because they're apples and they have nothing else better to do but to come to somebody's house and bust down the damn door. Um, here's the mirror, it's broken. Like you could see, knock the door down. I stop all the glass because I'm um, the cat or whatever, and they're assholes. They have a reason to take away that they took away because back in 2000, Andy made a threat to a website because they stole his idea for a movie script, and they t he told them that he that's the glass in there. He told them that that um he would come over there and kill them for stealing his script. But I mean, shit, like. Um, they kicked him off the website after they got what they wanted, like the information from his script and stuff like that, and then they just banned him from the website. I would be pissed off too, and like not only that, but that was years ago, like if Andy would have gave a shit and wanted to kill somebody, he would have done it already. And not only that, but like when they uh, came in this morning, the FBI, they fucking, they go all the way... Uh, to the point where they have to fucking bust the door down. I mean, come on, like, there's people out there that fucking molest kids and rape people and murder people, and they're gonna come in here and, like, act like it's a big damn deal and do that. And they manhandled him, too, for no reason, and he was being completely nice. He would never hurt anybody. He's, like, and he loves animals, and... He loves people. He would never do do anything to harm anybody. Yeah, he says, like, mean shit sometimes, but I mean, wouldn't anybody do that if they, like, were, you know, pissed off if they stole something that was rightfully theirs? We're gonna, we're gonna sue them for busting the stupid mirror down. I don't care 
if it's five damn dollars or if it's a hundred and or a thousand like it's not it just it wasn't necessary and I think they just do that sometimes just to get people excited and to get them to fight back because they know that Andy didn't do anything that um this wasn't even a serious matter so maybe they try we're trying to get a rise out of them who knows um they're assholes that's all I have to say and um I don't know I just feel that they should pay for what they did and they shouldn't have taken him because it's completely ridiculous and not only that but it's like laughable like why would they take him you know like he didn't do anything to anybody that was years ago and every like I I've made threats to people online before like I'm gonna drive to your house and beat your ass like and I'm gonna kill you but I mean, come on now, like, we have better shit to do, we have jobs like anybody else, we, ha we have a life, we don't fucking murder people, so get over it. Yeah, well, it sounds like a 12-year-old kid wrote this shit, because I'm frustrated and, I'm like, I'm not that smart, and I'm just speaking from my heart and saying, hey, you're a, a dickhole, buddy, and... And like I'm calling people pussies and stuff. Phil's coding stuff like, you told that one guy to stick his thumb up his ass and masturbate. <laughs> <laughs> you saw, who did you say that to? I don't know, he's reading all kinds of Larry shit. And I was reading this court shit, and man, the emails I sent back and forth are hilarious. It's just like Robert Hamburger. Like I couldn't stop I laughing.